day one of Upper Zambezi magic. This is uh, Winter Tigers episode two. It's a cold morning. It's like eight degrees at the moment. I'm here with my friend Sergio. I'm sure you. I'm sure you've saw, seen him in the previous uh, Winter Tigers video. It's a beautiful morning. It's misty. Fred, sure. are you excited to fish in this area for the first time? Very much. Very much. And how, how did it feel looking at the frenzies yesterday when coming up? Yeah, the water looks juicy. <laughs> Hopefully we are catching. Okay, that's yeah. good. This time we're here with a new boat. This is a new boat with a Suzuki 115. We actually converted this deck. We made this um, at 2 a.m. the night before we came. The deck is essential uh, when you're casting. Because, you know, it's more comfortable and you have more space to walk around. Anyways, without much further ado, let's get to the fishing spots. Okay, so I'm gonna run you through my setup. So here I've got a Shimano Crucial, six foot six medium heavy. This is the rod I always use for all my trips. I've got fish up to 20 pounds with this rod, and I think this is the best rod you can actually get for Tiger. I've got my Stella 4000 there. It's got a 40 pound braid, and I'm using a copper spoon right now. We just started fishing, so I'm gonna use a spoon and uh, 22 gram. And my friend Sergio there is using a jig, so he's using um, a bait caster there. It's a casking Max Steel and a Corrado DC, and he's using a purple jig. So, the reason why we use different lures is um, you never know what's actually working. So, in the beginning, when you're starting, it's always better to have a variance. If you're using jigs, use different colors. Um, but if you can use a spoon and a jig and whatever works best you can adjust um, with your friend according accordingly so let's get cracking it's beautiful nice weather Hello. switching over to another setup now this is a a casking megatron 3000 this is a max steel casking as well very budget you know low budget comp so the jig again but this is a bulldog jig Came back like three times, you know that. Thanks, man. Nice one. It's a beautiful fish, huh? Yes. yes. On the bulldog jig. So I got this beautiful seven pounder and a bulldog jig. It's a really nice fish. It took came like three times. <laughs> Let's release him. First fish of the day. Super excited. Yeah. Let's go for more. It was quiet, but um, with persistence, it always pays off. That probably is like the fifth. Probably what, 500 casts? 500 casts, yeah. <laughs> yes. We're just in a small channel here. It's a very narrow channel. But we managed to get something. Oh, oh, oh. 
Nee, mooi. Nimbue, man! <laughs> nice, thanks, Fred. Nice, man. And yes. just rolling. Look at this Nimbue. Robustus. What a beautiful fish to catch. Woo. Love it. So, look at this uh, beautiful Nimbue, also called uh, Serenochromis robustus. It's a beautiful specimen, very healthy fish. Let's chuck it back in the water. So we've actually seen quite a bit of action, um, a lot of birds in all of the areas where we had we have had good luck with fishing. So we're gonna hand over the GoPro to Fred here so that he can get a proper angle of all the fish we possibly might catch. Fred, are you ready? Yeah, very much ready. <laughs> Sergi, yeah. do this. Let's go. Let's do this. That was a nice one. Fred, if I hook a fish, then you. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. Yes, 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 yes. He's back again. He's jumping, he's jumping. There! Oh, oh, that's a bus! Mo, 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 mo. Take my camera. Oh, yeah. Take my camera so I can let it. Huh? You have to hold your drag, eh? Make sure you don't lose that one. That's one is deep. Jump. Jumping, jumping. Oh, nice. Yes. <laughs> on. On. Double up. Double up. Yes, 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 big yes, 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 Yes! yes. <laughs> what a fish! <laughs> wow! Yeah! Ma, ma, what ma, a monster! Ma, ma. Yes. What a monster! Yeah! Wow, holy shit! Look at this! Ma, 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 ma. Yes. I'm continuing. I'm this continuing. is literally a hundred dollar rod and reel. <laughs> oh wow, Fred. This looks like 18 plus. Yes. <sighs> Magnificent. Nice one. I'm gonna put this big girl back. Uh, holy shit. Oh, that one. was magical. What a fish. <laughs> Beautiful, man. Fred. We will die, we will die. <laughs> we go again. Ah, it's off. Yeah. <laughs> okay, guys, we're moving now. We're going to do one more drift that's near the camp, and um, from there, we'll call it a day. It was a good drift here. Um, did we catch anything? Yeah, only one small one. Oh, 
small one. Yeah, and we lost. We lost about two. And it's part and parcel of the game. Hey. hey, hey, hey. <laughs> it's off. <laughs> you know why I stopped? They're, st they're still coming. They're still coming. <laughs> now you're not going anywhere. Now you're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere, bitch. Yo! <laughs> it's rolling. Oh my gosh, my rod! Check the eyes. This side. This side. <laughs> That's sunset! <laughs> Is that a fish? Don't lose him, don't lose him. Hit him again. No, he's on, he's on. He's on. Careful of the motor. Sunset! <laughs> Beautiful specimen. Check him back. No, it's okay. It's okay. We fish. Photos later. We go back. You ready to come? Let's go. Okay, we can call it a day. It's a beautiful day, man. Amazing. Wow. Jump packed, full of action. I think this is a really, really good first day. Now, well fished. Nice, nice Fred. Nice one, Fred. Cheers, Fred. <laughs> nice one. Nice. Um, you did well today, honestly. And we'll call it the end of day one. We'll get back to action tomorrow. Let's go, Fred. <laughs>